All right, uh, good morning everyone and uh, today being the 10th of October 2024, I welcome you to a very important uh, update and encouragement towards uh, that which is being expected that the UAAG grant, the Theobad grant, the uh, Supreme grant and also the St. Rita Midwest Improvement Foundation grant. I greet you once again, all subscribers in Nigeria and diaspora, especially to all the CEOs and subscribers of UAAG uh, Sanctuary World Foundation. Uh, I must confess that we have all tried, having waited this far, but Ever still, your night is about to be over. Uh, night speaks of darkness, but for some individual, it speaks of light. <laughs> uh, like the Bible puts it, say, give not sleep to your eyes, else thou come to poverty. The time you wake up, it's your daylight. All right, so uh, there are some animals that are nocturnals that see well quite at at, in the night. You know, so night is not altogether a moment of darkness. So for those who trust in the process and who believe in their God, even this time that looks like a dark moment is a time of light for them because they shall be strong and they shall do exploit. So but whatever appears to be like your night in all of this waiting season, it's about to be ended. I must promise you that it's about to be over. There is a saying that uh, the chain is strongest at its weakest link. Let me take that again. Every chain is strongest at its weakest link. What that means is that uh, if you have, for instance, if you have a, a rubber band and you stretch it, you stretch it and stretch it, it will get to it will keep stretching until it gets to a point where it gets to an elastic limit and since it can't stretch any further it breaks you understand now every problem has an expiry period or let me say an expiry date it could stretch you and stretch you and stretch you but it will come to a point where after the stretching could no longer stretch any further. It breaks you right into your heaven of rest. And that's exactly what all these grants is all about. They have stretched a lot of people. And it's going to stretch you eventually into your graces. It will stretch you finally into your open heavens. Because we are climbing those stairs now where there is an elastic limit and about to be broken. Alright? So your day is about to be celebrated your night is about to be ended and many people will soon begin to say to you good morning <laughs> they will soon begin to testify about what has happened to you because they wouldn't know you anymore was that not that man that used to sit at the gate called beautiful what happened to him no a miracle had happened was that not that guy that was in expectation for uag grant what had happened to him see him now he has changed this is not how you look is because money hasn't arrived by the time it comes it will change everything around you it will change your name it will change your status it will change your surroundings all right so i want to believe that your day is about to break and those who knew you before, they begin to debate. Eh? <laughs> Real prosperity is debatable. Let me put it that way. Real prosperity. When people have not started debating about your, your wealth or your prosperity, it is not real prosperity. They begin to say, oh, it is not, is it not that same person? <laughs> what has happened? Oh, is it not that same woman? Oh, what has happened? Eventually they will say, well, his Lord, his God has remembered him. All right, my time too is coming. Oh, you know, so based on what happens to people that God has given the privilege to change, God has changed their raiment, changed their garment. People begin to say, all right, because of the successes they have seen around them, they begin to also tap 
into that success and say, well, my God too, that the God that remembered you would also remember me. And that would be your testimony where people can tap into what the Lord has done in your life to also climb on that pinnacle and be able to have faith and have confidence and say, well, we waited and finally it came through. We waited for it and it came through. You know, so that's exactly what's going to happen while we are in expectation of this uh, grant. Your morning is here, all right? So uh, I just want us to begin to pray more for uh, the country director, Apostle Ken Uwakama, for God's divine protection and also preservation on him. You know, sometimes when certain things happen to certain people, especially the set men, the Bible says, strike the shepherd and the sheep was scattered. In this in this um in this uh, regard now he is the country director and he is the set man here so all target is going to be against him both the world of darkness both people that are, are are hateful of the status why should it be him to get grant why shouldn't it not be me it could have been somebody better possibly this money would have come out you know a whole lot of things uh, 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 if you are if you are going to be a leader Mm? you cannot be selling ice cream <laughs> but if you want to be the leader that sells ice cream everybody will love you but if you must tell the truth and follow the real line and the detail as it's supposed to be you don't sell ice cream you just have to call a spade a spade and in calling a spade a spade sometimes you may have to step on toes sometimes you may have to make some people feel unhappy sometimes you might have to make some other persons feel un very happy but if everybody have to be happy at the same time you are selling ice cream you might not be a leader because the truth in itself does not make people to smile at all times there are times of spanking at the butt there are times of rubbing your back there are times of saying it exactly as it is all of these are the paraphernalia. They are all engulfed in the characteristics of leadership. So I believe that the country director needs our prayer now more often than not. The more it appears like it's not uh, uh, looking green, the more he needs our prayers. You understand? So pray for the country director. Pray for the NGOs and the CEOs. Pray also for yourself, especially for long life to be able to enjoy that which is coming for you. You will not die in the middle of your expectations. The same uh, uh, grant or the same expectations that you put your mind on, it will not cripple you before it comes. Your expectation will not cripple you before the, the same money comes out in the name of Jesus Christ. So ensure to commit yourself and others in the hands of God and the Lord will guide you on how to judiciously manage this world by the time it finally comes the bible says wisdom is the principal thing therefore get it and with all thy gettings ensure that you also get understanding so every one of us needs wisdom to go about this in the in, in the meantime i celebrate you all the ceos in the house i celebrate you i doff my cap for you all the grand handlers in the house i celebrate you i doff my cap for you all the expectant beneficiaries you, you, you know the most important aspect of this is that both the ceos including the country director we're all beneficiaries <laughs> we are all stakeholders in this business and we are all expectant beneficiaries so uh for you having waited this long i doff my cap for you it's just about to break so the good news is that it's just about to break so i celebrate your tenacity to hold on in spite of all odds i celebrate you i celebrate you i celebrate you all right if you are new to our channel don't forget always smash eh, that subscribe button because it is part of your business when you listen to us and we give you information on trending news and what is happening momentarily you know you have to also help the community grow so that it can reach to further uh, broader audiences so in the meantime we are drawing the curtain for this morning commentary we appreciate you for standing by us we thank you for uh, helping our community grow you too shall grow you shall have a transcendental growth in your finances in your family in your spiritual lives 
in your expectations there shall be growth in all phases of life i wish you a very wonderful thursday ahead of you god bless you don't forget i celebrated